Tommaso! Ah, Toma! Tira su! These are all Russian boars, and they are the tallest and lankiest of, of all the boar. About seven or eight months ago, there was rumors of this movie Hannibal. So we started looking for pigs, and, and it all sounded feasible. We knew we could find them. And uh, they pulled the trigger, I think, in March and said, go get them, because this, this was one whole sequence that they were very worried, and still are worried, since we haven't shot a frame of it. Um, but they wanted to make sure that, that that all will work. You know, they're meant to be killer pigs, but animals don't act. So you're, you're always in a predicament. You want them to be aggressive, but not too aggressive. Anthony is supposed to walk right through them. Well, they don't know Anthony. So, so how do you make them aggressive, but to the point where he can still go through them? So it, it, it's a real, it's a, it's a, it's a tightrope. What we've done is actually train them to go to a dummy and, and grab onto it. And essentially, it's just like a retrieve with a dog. You throw something out there and they go get it and shake it or whatever. That's what we've trained these guys to do. So what they do is we have a lot of prosthetic bodies. And they'll run and grab it and shake it and carry it. And once they do that, for initially, it's just very quickly for like a split second. And then you feed them. And then over time, you progressively make that time longer. And now they'll stand there for like a minute and shake and bite and tear at it. And then we feed them. And everybody goes, oh, well, they just put meat on the body. That doesn't really work. And we will do that at some point. But what will happen is they'll just stand there and eat. So they had to be taught to really shake and tear at things. And then what we've done is now we've transferred that to, to a person. We used the stunt coordinator, Phil Nielsen, and, and had them grab him and have had him do it for about a week and a half now and they actually jerk him off his feet and and run around with him really when we know they're going to work we put them in their stall we tell them what we want them to do and then we go away and we give them like 15 minutes to practice it and uh, we leave it at that